Hey YouTubers, JB Coins here with another Wednesday night live stream. Coin Snob, welcome. A little quiet out there, guys. Come on, wakey wakey. <laughs> That's alright, we got three people showing and two thumbs up. That works. Alright, bills and coins. Looks like you might have been first. Yeah, you were first. David Powers, welcome. Bills and Coins, welcome. Coin Snobs already said hi. Rochelle, welcome. Very cool. Jeff France, welcome. Mr. Breeze, welcome. As usual, we got lots of cool stuff tonight for giveaways and a few interesting things to talk about, probably. Mr. PS4, welcome. Pollock14, welcome. Alex, welcome. Bonnie, welcome. Robert Henry, welcome. Macro, welcome. Greg, welcome. Cosette, welcome. Richard, welcome. Richard, welcome. There's an echo in here. DC Bingo, welcome. Big Slim, welcome. S. Robbins, welcome. Trucking for Silver, welcome. Booger Herrera, interesting name, welcome. Daryl Ross, welcome. Keith Mead, welcome. Deanne, welcome. Big Bass Man, welcome. M. Ambrosius, welcome. Rocco Sue, welcome. Barbara, welcome. Joe Layton, welcome. Like Ambrosius said, how's everybody doing tonight? Hopefully a uh, good first half of the week. Got your sights on the holiday weekend. It's going to be a blazer here from what, I, weather, what our local weather people are saying. Pushing 100 every day from, I think, tomorrow till Tuesday. <laughs> Arizona Coins, welcome. Vonda, welcome. Janelle, welcome. P. Nelson, welcome. Been a long, strange day there. I can identify with that, Bonnie. David Powers, ready for that lovely sound of coins, tink, tink, tink. Yep, that's what Zoe always says, too, tink, tink, tink. Greg, don't need no storms. Yeah, it's, who knows? Yeah, Ambrosius, yeah, we're, we're, uh, we're on the East Coast. We're not far from the coast. And normally this time of the year, the average temp, the weatherman was saying, is 85. And they're talking about between 10 and 12 degrees air temp above normal. So 96, 97 or higher, which puts us really close to 100. And then with the humidity in there, they're talking like 105 to 110 heat indexes because of the humidity from tomorrow to, um, like I said, Monday or Tuesday. And that's like October weather. That's that's like the peak of hurricane season weather. And here it is, you know, official weather or official hurricane season starts on Tuesday, I think. So we've already had our first named tropical storm, but it was a fish storm. So that's a good thing. But uh, yeah, crazy, crazy week coming up. 
uh, weather-wise. Greg, welcome. Real Ruler, welcome. Ambrosius, yeah, it's that I was thinking of that out, you know, out by Vegas or Utah, places like that, you know, Arizona, it would probably be cold. Um, I've been in Utah when it was, you know, 105, 110, but it, it is a dry, it's like being in a dry sauna compared to a, a steam, a steam room. Uh, this place is a steam room, um, but, you know. <laughs> what, what can you do, you know? Ian, welcome. Yeah, you guys got some wicked weather in the middle part of the country. I saw that. Uh, it's not supposed to come this way. In fact, we're in a mild mild to moderate drought, they're saying. We really need the rain. Charles, welcome. Charles McDonald. Yeah, Vonda's right. Everybody that's in an area that's affected by bad weather tonight, make sure priority one is stay safe. We don't want to lose anybody, and we can always replace coins or laptops, but we can't replace y'all. we got a great family here, and, and we really don't want anything to happen to anybody. Uh, Robert Henry. Yeah, that was an awesome score, wasn't it? it? I wasn't sure how it was going to turn out, and when I opened the bottom of that, that you know, when I opened that box up with the uh, all new issue, it was like, oh man, I don't, you know, but that's no guarantee that there's going to be any W's in there. You know, I, I know, I know people that have gone through a couple of new issue boxes and got skunked. So to come away with, with 27 of them, um, you know, we, we wound up, uh, that and the, um, Lowell's we had, we wound up sending, I think, 29 coins. Uh, they went out yesterday, or day before yesterday. So it's snowing in Colorado still. Yeah, I saw that on the news that you guys are expecting, like, a foot of snow. It's a little late in the year for that, but it, that's wild, man. Um, yeah, I'll... P. Nelson, I'll bet you've had it with the rain. I know I know the Midwest and central part of the country is just nothing but floods. It's it's crazy. It's it, You guys are flooded and we're in a drought. I always wondered why the government didn't like create a gigantic pipeline like they have for oil where they could just pump the floodwaters, you know, somewhere else <laughs> where they need it. But, oh well. Eduardo, welcome. Wynn, welcome. For Kika, welcome. Yeah, man, bro, it's just rain here in the desert today, and my dog's freaked out. I think they've only seen it rain twice. Yeah, that I can imagine. Doesn't that usually cause, like, the desert to bloom whenever you do get the, the rare rain like that? I remember I remember something about that. I don't know if it's where you are or someplace else. Pammy J. Hi everyone. My back is out, so on meds. If I seem a little loopy, I am. No problem, Pammy. I, you know. Yep. Entry video is the Susan B. Like Ruler said, and Sweetie just posted there the link to it. Um. Jason Patton, welcome. And Pammy, I, I totally sympathize. I was at the doctor again today, and I'm getting to go in for a bunch more tests and possibly um, uh, another, um, I don't know what, they're, they're talking possibly an epidural for now in my upper back. I just went in for my lower back the last treatment and uh and now i'm having problems between my shoulder blades and um the doctor thinks that that might be another disc up there that's uh let go um more or less transferring you know when you can't you guys with the bad backs you weren't i'm wearing the back brace and 
you can't bend at the waist, so you bend at the shoulders and then you pick something up and it's basically taking the load right between the shoulder blades. So gonna be fun finding that stuff out. OU812, welcome. Josh P, welcome. Carl, welcome. Natasha, welcome. Natasha and Boris. Uh, <laughs> probably not the first time you ever heard that. Uh, Joni, welcome. Yeah, gonna be gonna be fun. I get I get I get two procedures, uh, uh, the kind that they knock you out for, so that they can. Uh, well, one they knock you out for, and 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 one they uh, keep you awake for, and then and then from there they'll figure out what they're gonna do. Pammy J blew her back out today. She's on meds, so. Lee the Lego Man, welcome. Robert Edwards, welcome. Ronnie Williams, welcome. Yeah, real, real Rocky and Bullwinkle rule, that's for sure, man. I don't know, Rocky, uh, my voice isn't doing too good tonight, so. No, that, was, that wasn't good at all. I know I can do uh hey, hey Yogi. <laughs> My voice is off tonight. I used to be able to do boo boo really good. And and I used to be I used to be able to do boo boo and then I used to be able to do is that a picnic basket <laughs> you got there? But like I say, tonight my voice is kinda so so um a little, little on the raspy side. But um we got 60 people watching and 52 thumbs up. I like that ratio. So, Pammy, yeah, you got to take care of your back, and hopefully the twins are really good doctors and, and take care of mom. Um, yeah, Robert, that, that was one that they were pushing on me really hard until you said that, and, uh, and somebody else said that it didn't work or that their nerves grew back or something, and it was like, nope, take that off the list. <laughs> Chasing Dragons, welcome. Um, only Silver, welcome. There you go. Let's get some picnic biscuits full of silver. Um... All right, so first one up tonight is Mr. Breeze. Yep, we still have rolls available. We have two boxes tonight, as always, and we actually are not sold out. So they're trying to help me, plus we are puppy sitting my mom's dog for the night. Oh, great. All three of them are bouncing off the walls. Well... Let mommy just lay on the couch and let the boys play with the dog, and you know, there you go. Um, so, as and I forgot, um, as usual at the beginning, what we usually explain real quick is I'm J, my beautiful wife behind me is B, that's where JB Coins came from. So, you can call me J, you can call her B, or Ms. B, or Mrs. B. Uh, the kids have other nicknames for us because they kind of look at us as like an aunt or an uncle, that kind of thing. Um, some of them do. Um, but um, we, uh, we run this as a family-friendly G-rated channel. Uh, Deom's Cans, welcome. From the PI, welcome. From the Philippines. Um, Thank you very much for coming. And uh, so, yeah, it's, it's a, it's a G-rated family channel. Um, we don't tolerate trolls, and we, try, we keep it very clean because there's a lot of little ones watching. Um, we've got Pammy's A and B. We've got uh, Zoe when she gets here. Hopefully she's feeling well enough to uh, get here with her dad. Um, we've got Howard and his granddaughter. We've got uh, Kim and, and uh, Caden, her son. We've got lots and lots of kids um, and grandkids, you know. So 
Um, and we've got some kids teaching their, their grown-ups <laughs> about this. So, um, so we, we've, we're very particular about keeping it family. And you'll see, the, the family takes care of each other. So everybody have a great time tonight. And uh, thanks for coming and spending your Wednesday with us. And uh, let's see, Mr. Breeze, I didn't see if you said where to start. So you get to pick how many down, how many over on the box, where we start. You have three rolls. Tony and Nero, welcome. JP, welcome. Mr. Breeze, where you at? I know I said hi to you. Mischief, welcome. Jen, welcome. Two down, three over. There we go. One, two, one, two, three. Okay, there's the first one, second one, third one. Mark roll. Black ring around the coin. We don't mark coins, we mark rolls. But that black ring signifies a 40 percenter. Thank you, sweetheart. 68D, 40 percenter. We also like to say we don't give no junk. That's a real good example of what we give away. We can't control what comes out of the rolls, but what, what you see in, in the giveaways that are in flips, uh, my sweetheart works very hard to find this quality of coins for you guys. Ramon Juan, welcome. Tim Newton, welcome. David Dottavia, welcome. Tina Rucker, welcome. Frank Ricks, welcome. All right. So, time to get started. Good luck to everybody. Good luck, Mr. Breeze. I knew something was wrong. Didn't have my chair in the right spot. There we go. I just needed a reposition. Nishad, Ansari, welcome. Heather, welcome. All right, if I miss anybody when I come in and I'm doing the coins, apologize. I say this every week. Because I'm looking at the coins, just like when if you have coins, I'm going to be looking at your coins. The camera's up here so that you have the bird's eye view of us opening the rolls. You can tell that we're opening them. There's no tears in the rolls or cuts in the rolls where we've stuck special coins to make it look like it's better than it is. It's the real deal. But the laptop is over that way. Um, and that's where the, the stream is. So like Lee the Lego Man, welcome. I might have said hello already, but I'm not sure. So, but that's an example. So, time to focus on coins. Tink, tink time.
and M and K, welcome. I forgot to say hi to A and B too. I'm sorry, guys. I was so worried about your mom. I forgot all about saying hi to you guys. Hope you have fun tonight, but you gotta take care of mama, okay? You guys be good doctors. Okay, Mr. Breeze, sorry on the rolls. We didn't do much other than the Mark 40 percenter, but you have one pull. So, sweetie, if you could hand me the pull bag, please. Sorry, that's okay. All right, so time to start this. Good luck, Mr. Breeze. Forty percenter. There we go. So sixty-seven to go with your sixty-eight. So there you go. Two beauty forty percenters coming your way. Thank you very much. Congratulations. And we have still we still have rolls available if anybody wants them. And Tony Yanero is up next. Tony's got five rolls. No marked rolls. Oh, very cool. Yeah, I didn't even think of that. This weekend they'll get to stay up with the family. That's cool. First, they got to be good doctors to mama and, and take care of her before they go to bed. Robert Fitz, welcome. Frank, um, there's a couple different ways. 
one obviously is to have them watch our live streams, particularly like on a Saturday or Sunday. There's more people. On Saturdays, we do more boxes. So we tend to find more simply because of the volume. Um, and um, the other thing is you can find them. They, they make so many different coins now, not just circulated coins, but they make, uh, there's quite a few mints that are making very unique coins that, um, you know, like if he's into Marvel, if he's into the Avengers, that kind of stuff, you know, what, sweetie? Oh. Ah, gotcha. Gotcha. Tony, sorry, nothing in those rolls. And apologize, everybody. I know you guys probably can hear me chewing. Yeah, you usually can. So, Tammy, welcome. Yeah, no Ida so far. Uh, no Kim so far. No Donna Mac or John so far. Um, no Vicky or Mark. Um, so, let's see. Tony's got three pulls. Good luck, Tony. Blank on the first pull. There you go. Bonnie's the expert on that stuff. blank on the second one. Come on. Forty percenter. There we go. Give me a, how about a nice shiny 67? Excuse me. For Tony. Excuse me. Got the hiccups now. Thank you, Tony. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me while I try and get rid of these hiccups. Okay. Um, oh man, Scott's dad had to go back to the hospital today. Yeah, definitely have to pray for him. Drink water upside down. Yeah, that's one of them. Yeah, I just, I do the Sharon technique. I just, you know, kind of hold, hold your breath and just Take uh, six to ten swallows, and it always works. <clears throat> Heather, it, the odds in the bag never change, okay? Um, we set it up. Um, the B actually made the bag, and... Um, um, and then we set it up. Initially, we had coins and flips like that in there, so we you know, couldn't feel what they were. And uh, some of them didn't have a coin in them, or they, you know, but um, they were tearing the bag up, so she had to wind up lining the bag. 
Um, I don't remember what the percentage of coins in the bag, how we, how we worked it out. Yeah, it's under the video. It, yeah, I don't remember. Uh, it, we did it so long ago. But it's, it's below the video. Um, Chasing Dragons, welcome. Steve Peregrine, welcome. The one and only Mason, welcome. <clears throat> so, we ready to go, baby? Okay. So, uh, yeah, like we said, don't forget we do have rolls available. Um, usually we're sold out before we even go live on a Wednesday, so we actually have some available for a change. Um, Jamie Empranto Harris, welcome. So Daryl is up next. Daryl has three rolls. One, two, three. Another marked roll. Another black one. 40 percenter. All right. Let's do another 67. Got into a real nice batch of, of 67s that are really pretty this, this last haul. So... <clears throat> yeah, we, um, for you new folks, we don't believe in, in marking coins, um, so um, we mark, like you see, we mark the bottom of the roll, uh, that's the one I opened, uh, we mark the bottom of the roll. And in each box, we, we mark four. Normally, we, we mark four. The other night, we marked, uh, we marked it twice by mistake, so there were eight instead of four. Um, which, you know, sometimes we do it on purpose, but we did that one by accident. But it's uh, out of the four, three of them are green, which are 40 percenters like this one. And the fourth one out of a box, if it's green, it's either a Benji or Walking Liberty. If we pull out of the black bag a 90 percenter, it's a 64 Kennedy 90 percent. But if we pull a green out of the box, it's a Walking Liberty or a Benji. And again, we don't give away junk. These are nice coins, okay? Um, and yeah, the other night we, we had a box where there were two greens and six 40 percenters instead of, you know, three and one. What, sweetie? Hey, Barbara. Welcome. Troy, welcome. Michael Kittle, welcome. Trying to eat my dinner here and do this at the same time. 2009 D. Nipsey. Pretty nice one. Yeah, pizza guy showed up literally two minutes before we went live, so apologize. Ooh.
The front is plain and it's in real nice shape. Look at the colors on the back. It's blue toning in here. It's still like clad color here, but it's uh, like green and gold up here and a little bit of pink. So that is, Ida refers to these as one and, and B as well uh, as wannabes because they're not completely full rainbows. No. Um, so this one's yours. First rainbow of the night, cool. And that's on a 74. And like I said, the front on the 74 is in pretty decent shape. So that should make for a nice rainbow when it's uh, when it's fully matured. Keep that in uh, in a paper envelope of some sort. We actually have the little two by two paper envelopes um, that we put our rainbow coins in on our website, jbcoins. Inc.com. We have all this stuff, all the coin supplies, the microscope, the handheld magnifier, the $8 scale, which comes in really, really handy, especially if you go to a coin show or an estate sale or a garage sale, you carry this in your pocket. And if you see something that you're not sure, you can weigh it on here. Eight bucks, man. And, and that thing uh, really saves your butt. Um, <laughs> uh, let's see, Domino's, I'm just going to answer all the questions here. I see them. Welcome. Becky Boo, welcome. Um, no, the, uh, uh, the front is, uh, Ambrosius is the front on the, on the rainbow is not toned at all. So that's what I mean by plain. It's, you know. Um, Carlos, absolutely. We've got plenty of rolls left tonight. All right, back to Daryl's rolls. So, Daryl has one pull. Good luck, Daryl. Ah, blank. Can play this game tonight. Okay, it's back. Whoop. That's a knock over Mr. 300 over here. So we have 100 likes? Mm -hmm. Very cool. So, yep, 100 likes triggers the first giveaway. And then at the end of every box, we have a giveaway. So tonight we'll have two giveaways at the end of one at this end of this box, one at the end of the second box. This is the first giveaway, correct? Yeah. Good. Okay. This is from Charles. How did he do that? Another toner from Charles. Uh, Rainbow, 1998, Philadelphia. Very cool coin. Very nice shape. So thank you, Charles. Say what? Uh, I said hi to Pollock14. Yeah. 
I thought I did. If not, hi, hi Pollock14. Um, all right, so we have 78 entries. Wow, good odds. Um, good luck. And we've got our timer. Makro, the Greek stacker. Are you stacking Greeks now? Or, you know, I'm not sure. I don't really collect these, but great info as always. Cool. Say hi to who? Yeah, I did when he came in. Yeah. I just I just realized reading the the new name on the screen there that um, you know he's stacking Greeks, that that just all kinds of thoughts run through the mind. Um, <laughs> got about half of the sand gone, so Makoto, you probably got a a, a real serious lag going. Um, I know he was here. Macro. Sand's almost gone, Macro. The timer is exactly one minute, and it's sand, so it doesn't cheat. Sand is gone. Dynamic, yay, welcome. Yep, Makro's not here. Either that or he fell asleep or, or he's got one heck of a lag. Uh, again, we forgot to mention before we do the draw any giveaways like this to refresh your, your chat. So, but unfortunately the time has expired, so we have to go to the next person. So, next, good luck to the next person. Jenny Zorro, is this an entry? Yes, it is. Welcome, Jenny. I hope you're here. Francisco Galindo, welcome. Wow, I wonder where he went to, ruler. Den, welcome. Glenn, welcome. Jenny Zorro, come on, there you are. Yay, congratulations. You're gonna, if you like rainbows or tone coins, you're gonna like this coin. It's very cool. It is from um, Charles. He sent us a whole bunch to, uh, yeah, we're, we're, we're running low, but he's, yep. Got a couple left. Rusty, dusty, and cool. That sounds like me. <laughs> Welcome. All right. So, yeah, I like that name. That's why I said sounds like me. Only with me, it'd probably be rusty, dusty, old, and cool. <laughs> All right. So we did Daryl. JP. Yep. Oh, yeah, you're right. You can't see it, can you? It's off camera. Let's see if I move it closer. I moved up. Now I see how much of a lag I've got. I need to refresh mine real quick because I've got a serious lag. Okay, fix that, fix that. Arigato, welcome.
KCC, welcome. Yeah, it's kind of early for a thumbs down, but if, if someone did that by accident, just for the heck of it, if someone did that by accident, all you have to do, and I apologize for talking my mouth full, is hit the thumbs down a second time, and it'll go away. And then you can go ahead and turn that into a thumbs up and help the family. If, however, it's one of the trolls or one of the folks that got themselves banned from the channel for not behaving, thank you for coming and leaving the thumbs down and leaving because it counts as a view. So thank you very much for helping. Uh, so I think it is Sharon is our, our resident troll. We now have two. So <laughs> anyway, JP, two rolls, no marks. Good luck. Looks like one to me. That's whoa, that's what I thought too. Nineteen ninety. Uh looks like a D, but you can see the toning. It's it's harder to get the color, especially on this side. Let's see if I can turn this around with my fingernails. Oh man. Gotta do it this way. Hi, Linda. So on this side, you can kind of see the toning better. It's got uh, pinks and greens and orange. Really, really bright colors. It's really pretty. So there's another rainbow. Okay. Okay. Um, yep. Forgot to remind folks, if anybody is sending a donation to the PayPal account, if it's for rolls, please mark on the, in the comment section that it's for rolls for tonight. Um, if it's for, you know, coin lists, uh, Aaron Variety coin lists off the website, jbcoinsinc.com, uh, indicate that. You know, if it's something other than rolls, whatever, whatever it's for, please indicate what it is. And also, it says it on here, but if you didn't read it, um, please include your YouTube screen name if you use a different name than your real name. Because otherwise, all we're going to get from PayPal is your real name. And we don't want to accidentally disclose your personal name on the Internet that's going to live there forever. Um if that's not your intention. So we, we try very hard to protect everybody's privacy. Yeah. Yeah, we, we try to use first name for that reason. But, um, I mean, for example, that's why I just use J and she just uses B. That's not our names. It's just our initials. Um, but it's for, it's for privacy and security reasons. Okay, nothing there, JP, unfortunately. Um, and you have one pull, so it kind of depends on how well that goes. Leanne, welcome. Oh, if you... Um, Warren, welcome. If you did send a uh, donation and you didn't indicate what it's for, you can just go ahead and send an email to jbcoinsinc at gmail.com without the PayPal part. That's our email. And you can just send an email, B will get it, saying, hey, I sent X amount of dollars and it, 
I meant for it to be for coins or whatever. Okay. That way you don't have to disclose it on the, on the uh, stream. Esperanza, welcome. All right, so JP, one pull. Gotta make it a good one. Forty percenter. There we go. Let's try a sixty-eight D. How's that? Nice, pretty one. Congratulations, JP. Thank you very much. Um, I saw one or two at the very beginning, but yeah, there's a lot more folks here now. Um, Sweetie wants to know what you guys think about um, our score on those W's that we posted up that video. That was, that was mind-blowing for us. It was, it was lots of fun. Yeah, Donna Mac, uh, Mrs. B is, is feeling normal tonight. She's feeling good. Oh, Donna wasn't feeling good. That's right. Yeah, so she's feeling better too. That's good. Um, yeah, that was 15,000 quarters in a, that, it, that it took, I think, three or four days total to go through all of those boxes because the the box that was all American memorials, I was checking them not only for the W's, but I, I also went through and checked for gradable coins. And, um, and then the other boxes, I was checking for um, not only W's, but I was also checking for collectible coins and errors and silver and all that stuff. So it, uh, okay. Oh, okay. John Holder, welcome. Um, we are missing your address for some reason. So we've got some stuff here that we have not been able to send out to you. So if you could uh, shoot us your address at, at, the, uh, ad, at the email address, jbcoinsinc at gmail.com, um, that would be awesome. And hopefully you win something tonight and have to do it anyway. Anybody that wins something, you have to send us an email with your screen name, your real name, your address, and what you won. Uh, but you only have to do it once a week. And um, let's see. Oh, yep. Good catch. This is JP's as well. The rainbow. Thank you, P. Nelson. So, next up, Heather. Heather has three rolls. No mark rolls. Very cool. Um, Thank you, S. Robbins. Yeah, that's kind of how we felt as we, as we as I was going through those, and I started calling out what you know. I got one. I got one. You know, poor B wasn't feeling good still at that point, and she was like, she was feeling much better after. <laughs> you know, I'm counting them out. You know, 16, 17. She goes, what? <laughs> Kim, welcome. Hopefully you're feeling better and Caden's feeling better and you're both here. That'd be great. Just waiting to see if you guys are going to show up. Um, so, yeah, good luck, Heather. Tracy, welcome. So, no mark rolls on Heather's. We do still have rolls available, which is a rarity on Wednesday nights.
Okay. Two thousand two Denver NIFC first year of NIFCs. Yes, please. Yeah, Scott. Same thing that Ruler said. Oh. Well, it's good they got it out. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm going to have the boss double check me on that coin. I think it might be a wannabe. Can't really tell. Hmm. Tiny, welcome. Hopefully little Zoe's with you too. How's how are you both doing? Last roll, Heather. What do you think about this one, sweetie? It looks kind of weird to me. I'm not sure if that's actually a rainbow or not. Okay. So, sweetie says that that is, in fact, a rainbow. It's it's a it's a wannabe, as we call it, as Ida calls it. It's got a blue uh, a blue patina that started in in this area here. And uh, it's got a little bit of pink. And then it's still clad color on this side. So it's, it's a baby rainbow. So again, put that in a paper envelope. But it's pretty. Funny money, welcome. Ryan Anderson, welcome. Heather, one pull. <laughs> Donna Mac, I want it, I want it, I want it. Well, that's like the third one we've pulled already tonight, I think. 40 percenter. There we go. If you only got one pull, make it a good one. Excuse me, 67, 40 percenter. That's for Heather. Thank you very much. Okay, Tony Yanero is up again. Five more rolls. No mark rolls. Mm. 
Yep, micro. No, Troy, I didn't get any on me. It's a lot easier when she feeds me cookies because it just kind of jams those in my mouth. But trying to take a bite of pizza without touching it while she's holding it. It's a new challenge altogether. <laughs> no macro is not messing with you, man. Nope. You can see beautiful toner. Yep. Beautiful toner. Those are Heather's coins? Did I give you Heather's coins off of here? No. Yep, then I did it again. Sorry, Heather. Yeah, real ruler got me. Thank you very much. Uh, Frank, it's a Domino's plain old cheese, double cheese. Joe, welcome. Oh, Caden's getting better. Is that what I'm catching the drift here from Bonnie? Nathan, welcome. Got some weird colors on the side of this one. Let's see what that tur turns out to be. Well, there's a spray painted red coin with the paint worn off. There's a nasty bicentennial. Another nasty bicentennial. Michigan Mud Digger, welcome. Nothing in the rolls again, Tony. Bummer. 
See if we can't do some good on the poles. Got three poles this time. <laughs> Blank on the first poll. Mud Digger has to watch the Game of Thrones finale tonight. Okay. Wayo, Casilla, welcome. Blank on the second poll. Come on, Tony. We got to get you something good. Smurf girl, welcome. Ah, blank. Tony, sorry. Yeah, B's going. Oh no. <clears throat> All right. Next up is Frank. Frank has 10 rolls. Two, four, six, eight, nine, and 10. Let's check it out for Mark rolls. One Mark roll, black one, 40 percenter. Very cool. Uh, yeah, Frank. Good luck, Frank. 68, 40 percenter. <laughs> JP's going to watch the finale too. All right. You guys have a good time. They're going to go watch that. We're going to leave good odds for the folks that are still here. That's a Denver. I thought that was an S. Wow, very cool, Ryan. Full steps on a 48-year-old coin. That's awesome. Robert Worley, welcome. Linda, yes, all nickels are supposed to have the FG on the back. Partial band? No, there's no partial band designation for Mercury Dimes.
Okay, we're stuck on likes at 123. The next giveaway is at 150 and at the end of the box. Um, so you want to leave uh, a comment at the in the video that we posted today to um, get entered into all the giveaways for the night. And they're totally free, but you have to be here when we call your name out, as Makro found out. We use our sand timer that was made for us, and it's exactly a minute. So when the sand runs out, your time runs out, and we call the next person. So the sand don't care unless you're there. <laughs> and we still have rolls available, Sweetie says, which is a rarity on Wednesday, and it's probably because of Game of Thrones. Real ruler, same guy, Frank Gasparo. Corrigan, welcome. Yeah, Ruler, we haven't watched a single episode of it either. Yeah, macro, that, uh, macro, macro, that's why, um, <clears throat> I told you my voice is messed up tonight. Um, that's why getting that designation, it's, it's like getting a full step designation. It's not as easy as it sounds. doing puppy we're eating pizza and he's standing here in the middle of the room and licking the air <laughs> is the best way to explain it <laughs> crazy dog I think he lost his mind since those videos came out. I think yesterday and the day before or today. I don't know. Last couple days. Yeah, Tiny's here. Yeah. Yeah, Tiny's here. I didn't see how he and Zoe are doing. Excuse me. This is B. Tell. Me, Jay, to tell new people how to go out of chat to push thumbs up and come back. Um, actually, Ruler could tell them that um, better than I could because it depends on what kind of device they're on. Um, I 
Ah, sweetie says if you're on the phone that you just have to minimize tap on the chat. Okay, tap on the chat, she says, and it'll minimize, and then that'll give you the ability to hit the like button, which is basically just a thumbs up. Two thousand two Denver Nifsey, first year NIFC. Don't blame me, Tony. Yeah, Tiny's video about the challenge coins were very cool. Tiny, did you um, did you see my? Uh, I left you a message there. You were asking about what the one symbol meant. Hopefully, you saw that. Yeah, basically anybody that ever saw the movie Hunt for Red October, that's the kind of boat um, or sub that um, that that challenge coin was. Those challenge coins were from um, fast attack subs. Yeah, awesome, awesome movie and very realistic and never gave the Sub Submariners any grief because their, uh, their job was always high stress and you're basically locked in a, in a tube that's about 30 foot in diameter, I think, if I remember right, uh, which is not much bigger, not much wider than a two-car garage. Um, and that's in both directions, obviously, because it's round, you know. But you have, depending on where you are in the sub, you have, um, sometimes you have one deck and sometimes you have two decks. And, um, you know, you might, especially the fast attack subs like that, they basically lay quiet most of the time in passive mode and wait for, waited for the Russians to come by, and, uh, and then they would just trail them without making any noise. And yeah, talk about claustrophobia, and you can't make a sound, and man, that would, I, I couldn't do it. You don't see daylight for months at a time, sometimes, you know, four, five, six months at a time. It's like, no way. And um, let's see, Frank, that's all we got out of the rolls. Let's see if we can get anything out of the pings. Um, the, um, what a lot of people don't realize or don't know if they're, unless they're history buffs like me, that during World War II, there were more guys 
that were killed in action in submarines than there were in the Air Corps, for example, the bombers that went down, you know, um, which is just a staggering number of people. Um, it, it's just, you know, my hat's off to anybody that was a submariner. It's just, it's just blows me away. Six poles, Frank. Good luck. See if we can add to the silver pile. Blank on the first one. Leviathan, welcome. Maria, welcome. eBay. eBay is the answer for Maria. 40% are on the second poll. That's much better. Sixty-eight. Oop, oh, you already got a sixty-eight. Let's put that back down. Let's put down a sixty-seven. That was the second one. We got four poles left. Forty percent are on the third pull. Sixty-six, forty percenter. Yeah, Clancy was an insurance salesman when he wrote his first book. Isn't that, isn't that wild? So three pulls left. blank on the fourth one. Blank on the fifth one. Not cool. All right, Tony, you take care. Give Zoe a hug and a kiss from us. Tell her feel better. Forty percenter. Very nice, 1965. So you got 65, 66, 67, and 68. Forty percenters. Sorry, it wasn't more. And you've got a 2002 NIFC. First year of NIFCs. Congratulations. Thank you, Frank. We do still have rolls left in the second box. John's up next. John has two rolls. Yeah, we still haven't pulled the green one, have we? No. Oh. Let's see. John has to. I've got him in my hand. I'm trying to do a little math here. Are we... Is the first box sold out yet? Yeah, this is the oh, box. yeah. This is the first box, but we still have rolls left in this box, and we have not pulled the green yet. So, no marks on John's two rolls. That's what I was... I was looking at the numbers, and I'm going, wait a minute. <laughs> We're not sold out on this box yet. That's very very rare on a Wednesday night. I'm blaming it on Game of Thrones. <laughs> or, well, yeah. Who knows what the holiday weekend? Oh, really? Uh, that's why Ida's not here? She went? Okay.
Ooh, Leviathan, you had a tornado near your city? You, so you're okay though, right? Yeah, that we actually did a video on that guy a long time ago when he did that, John. Um, ours just didn't take off like that video did. Um, it was 5,130, right? Because you've got 513,000. I don't think it was that much. <laughs> Let's see. Woof. Yeah. Tulsa, Tulsa, uh, Oklahoma City, Tulsa, that corridor, man. That always made me nervous driving cross country when it was tornado season. Hey Seth, welcome. Okay, nothing in the rolls, John. Um, you got one pull. So is that you know the rule? If things get hairy, take cover because you're more important to us. We want you to stay safe. 40 percenter for John. There we go. There you go. 68D. Thank you, John. Ah, okay, Seth. Um, yeah, before we lose too many people to um, Game of Thrones, if we haven't already, um, we have two boxes today. We're still on box number one, and we still have rolls in box number one, and we have not found the green one yet. So... <laughs> or, or like B, B just said, or unless I forgot to put it, um, like, like putting too many in the last box. Um, but um, I know Real Ruler is gonna appreciate this one, and uh, if um, um, Santiago was here, he probably would <laughs> be emailing me like crazy or emailing us like crazy uh, after I mentioned this. Rocky Superstar, welcome. Good timing. Uh, Kimi Wan Hackett, welcome. Um, those of you that have been around a while know that um, we've shown the puppy um, opening rolls of half dollars, and we've talked about uh, for probably two months, we've talked about shooting a video. You guys have actually asked us to shoot a video about him opening rolls and, and sniffing out silver. Well, um, one of the channels that um, tends to do live streams at the same time we do. Yeah, and... Um, and they're actually a little bit after us, usually time-wise, because they're out in California. And they've, they've even popped in to our video uh, stream a few times, our live stream, and said hi to everybody. And we said hi to them. Um, normally, you know, two different audiences, so not a big deal. Time overlap, not a big deal. We've talked to them before when they were, you know, a smaller channel. Um, but um, they actually 
seem to have gone out of their way um, to do something very uncool. And frankly, we're both a little ticked off about it. We just don't really know how to respond to it other than to bring it up here. Huh? No, we won't respond to it directly to them. Um, yeah, I know, sweetie. I'll get there. Sweetie, sweetie is very upset, and she, she, as you know, she works very hard to um, to do the content for the for our channel and everything. So when somebody copies us or uh, somebody does something intentional, where they're basically ripping off our content or ripping off ideas that people uh, talk about in the stream, like. We've said, you know, that that happens, and we've said, please don't discuss it in the stream because this happens. Please send us a private email if you'd like to see us do something to jbcoinsinc at gmail.com. And, and this time it was me talking with you guys in the stream about puppy opening, you know, the ability to open the rolls. Um, like I say, for the last month or two, and we actually had <laughs> the really sick part is we, we actually had and I'm hesitating to, to even bring up the guy's name but it's pretty obvious um, we had this guy not only visit the channel several times and I'm pretty sure based on the fact that they shot not only one, but the next day shot a second video of their little French bulldog uh, and used the term puppy searching silver or something like that. That was the title. And uh, Snacks did that one and put three rolls down on the table. The center one's got a Walking Liberty on it. And... You know, he's saying, yeah, we trained the dog to sniff out silver. Watch. And he, at, he, you can see him palming something. And he, right before he has the dog indicate which roll has the silver, he puts a piece of bacon on the walking liberty. And, of course, the dog goes to the piece of bacon and then takes off, right? Uh, that was the second video. The first video was um, his sidekick um, basically having the little dog running all over his lap and, you know, uh, getting up on the table and, you know, what are you doing looking for silver, you know, and all this kind of stuff. And, and just, you know, I mean, they, they used the title puppy in both videos, puppy trained to do, you know, and yeah, that's, that's how we feel about it. That's absolutely trash. It's garbage. It's a blatant ripoff. Sweetie's comment over and over today uh, and yesterday was, you know, why don't, why don't you spend your time making your own content instead of ripping ours off? The problem is we can't copyright it, John, because we didn't shoot the video first. We've been talking about it in the live stream for months. We didn't shoot the video. So now if we go do the video that we've been talking about and put it up, it looks like we're copying them. And in theory, they could complain to YouTube that we're violating their copyright. So now we're not even sure that we can shoot the video, but we think we're going to probably do it anyway just to be in your face. And, and if they do file a complaint, we're probably going to tell YouTube, hey, check out our live streams for the last two months. You know, and the fact that these guys were in the live stream saying hi and all this kind of stuff. So if you guys are here lurking, watching, you know, get some class. I, I mean, I know the very few times that we've watched the, the stuff you put out there, I can't, I can't listen to it. I can't take it. You know, it's like watching a couple three-year-olds stuff their faces with food and, and act like idiots. And you mark coins and you do all the wrong things. And you happen to find 100, 150-year-old, you know, expensive very rare um, coins that are gradable in your rolls, you know? 
and never the roles you're giving to somebody. Always the roles you're keeping. So it's just, we don't usually go after somebody like this, but it's just, it, it, it just so low rent. You know, we've got two other channels, one that copies us constantly, and you can, you, can, you can match up the videos. We post a video and the same day or the next day at the latest, he posts the same video, same thumb th th thumb thumbnail, um, you know. And he's, he's just a, a snot-nosed kid. And actually, the other guy and, and I and, and, and B have talked to him, you know, to talk, have talked to each other because they got into a war with each other at one point. And because... The young guy did that to them, and they thought that it was low rent. And you know, we told them, "Yeah, that's that's really a classless move." You know, so now both of these guys that are, that are ripping off our content, you know, they've done it to each other. But now the second guy who we defended is is doing it to us, and and doing it in a comical way to make fun of us, knowing that we're kind of in a trick bag. So it's just, it's just really aggravating, you know? Um, so yeah, we're very proud of our content and thank you very much. Um, you know, but yeah, they were, they were living, they were living somewhere, um, Colorado, I think. Um, and now they've moved to Florida. I mean, uh, California, excuse me. So, um, yeah, the highest form of flattery is imitation, Tony, but, you know, um, it's, uh, it's kind of aggravating. And, you know, they got more subscribers than we do, quite, quite a bit more subscribers than we do. Um, so, you know, again, it's, it's like, you know what, dude? You made your channel by doing uh, live streams and coin roll hunts. You just recently started shooting videos. Um, make your own, you know. Um, if you'd like, we'll be glad to teach you how to how to figure it out. But don't rip us off anymore. Um, and 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 that's 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 it. I I you know, it's. Um, You know, yeah, it's, um, Kayla, welcome. Okay. Um, you talking about their channel? Because we're not all about that. <laughs> Really? Guess what, Kayla? So are you. Bye-bye. Obviously a troll for them. Or just a troll in general. Yeah, SWAT. I like that. Yep. Uh, yes, Bonnie, there are still rolls left. Uh, last I knew, there actually are rolls left in this box, and we still haven't um, found the green one in this box yet. And the other box obviously has a green one and three black ones. So, so thank you, Rocky. And um, thank you, Mischief. Um, yeah, we... Uh, God, there's so many things that I'd love to tell you guys that 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 we're working on and you know they're that are happening because of what we have all created as a family channel. But I don't want to give them any warning. Uh, I'm I'm just I'm just I'm tired of of you know the open and honesty policy that I've had um, doing that kind of stuff and and. B has told me a couple times, you know, stop talking about that because, you know, they're going to rip us off. And it's like, it's like, how are they going to rip us off on that, you know? Well, like I say, they not only did it, but they did it twice, two days in a row, and made a joke of it the second day. 
and the second day video is all of like 45 seconds it's like it's like yeah okay that's that's not challenging us or throwing something in our face right so anyway we've given them too much time uh more than they deserve um and um so you know what are you going to do but anyway we're going to get back to the box uh kyle is up next two rolls no markings good luck kyle uh let me see if i can do that while we're live b had to step out of the room There you go, Macro. All right, so Kyle, good luck. John L, welcome. Leviathan, I like your logic. <laughs> There's a 71 rainbow. Again, it's a wannabe. It's right around the bottom and it goes just about to the top of his head there's at least three colors on there uh kyle okay I just had to wipe out a troll for uh, the guys that ripped us off. Yeah, yeah. She 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 went on and on about how boring uh, we were because we're all about pennies and nickels and dimes. And it's like, who are you talking about? And she goes, you guys. And I went, really? Well, guess what? You are not. Click. Bye. See ya. You know. <laughs> No, but I mean, she was obviously a troll for him. And I even said, if you're, if you're lurking in the background watching us, you know. <laughs> so they got an earful if they did listen. Or if they watch it when it becomes a video, they'll get an earful. So, Kyle, sorry, that one was a blank. You did get... Um, a rainbow, a uh, wannabe rainbow, but a, a rainbow, if I can pick it up. I don't like touching the face. I don't ever like touching the face, but especially when it's got a rainbow started. You can see it right here. So, so that's Kyle. Thank you, Kyle. Carlos is up next. Carlos has four rolls. Um, everybody said they're not happy and, um, uh, uh, yeah, they, you know, 
they're they're in shock and 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 they're not happy and you know so and a couple people knew right away who I was talking about even though I didn't mention their names yeah they were from Florida then Colorado and now California right and it's like yep that would be them so Yeah, especially when, like I, like, like I said, and you were out of the room at the time, I said, you know, all they've done for the couple of years that they've been on YouTube, you know, they've been on ha at least at least half as long as we have, if not less. But um, pretty much all they did for the first year or two was coin roll hunts. That's it. And eat food. Um, right. And then about... Six months or so ago, they started shooting videos while they were doing the live streams of coins they found in the live stream, you know, and making that into a video. But it's like, and now they're trying to create videos and obviously don't know what the heck they're doing because they, they don't even know the name of the coins that they find most of the time. Yeah. The... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweetie just said, and it's ironic because we have in the giveaway here tonight uh, the Colombian Exposition coin, right? And the, when they found one of these, the, oh, it was give, they were giving it away? Oh, they were giving these away, and the doofus called it the Columbus coin. Every time he gives one of these away. Oh, that, my, that's my favorite. It's the Columbus coin. If you read it right here, it says Colombian half dollar. Hmm, must be made in Colombia. And then if you read it back, it says Colombian Exposition, World's Colombian Exposition, Chicago. You know, oh well. Like we said, enough said. Yeah, that is a sweet coin. The first Commemorative ever was the 1892 Columbian Exposition, and we already gave that one away to Tiny. This is the 1893 because the exposition was basically the forerunner to the World's Fair. They called it the City of Lights. And so the second year, they made the same coin. Those are the first two commemorative coins that the Mint produced. And after that, they've been making commemoratives ever since. And um, so it's just, it's just, funny as heck that you know here you've got a very historic issue coin in your hand and you're giving them away and you know it must be an elementary school dropout yeah and he doesn't know the name and he's a coin channel you know not knowing the name to one coin is something else and is one thing but when you're when you're buying the coins and giving them away that's that's no. Oh well. Yep. So, Carlos, we're through one roll and we don't have anything yet. That's not good. Nope, still didn't find the green one. And I think we got one or two rolls left in this box. I don't think it's sold out. It is sold out? Oh, okay. Sorry. So we are in box number two? Okay. But box number two is not sold out. Not yet. Okay. Bummer. Nothing in the rolls, Carlos, but you got two pulls, so let's see if we can find you some silver there. Uh, Sharon, no, that's the wrong channel, I think. They've got more than 61,000 subs, right? No, they have more. Well, I don't know. Oh, really? That's, that's what they have? I don't know. I think they have more than us. I thought they had more than us. 
a f well, you know, I mean, I don't know. That's that's how little I pay attention to them, you know. So. Blank. Blank on the first one. So, Carlos, we got to pull on this one here. If we're going to get you something. Bills and coins? Perfect explanation. Yep. Forty percent. There we go. Sixty-seven, forty percenter for Carlos. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Charles is up next. Five rolls. One. So, oh, sorry, Charles, not yet. Linda is up next. Didn't have it on my copy. Okay, so Linda has six rolls. So I've got two here. Four. Six. All right, and Charles has the last five. Okay. That works. All right, Tony, thank you. Oh, green one, there it is. Linda found it. 90 percenter. Sweetie, I need, I need something for Linda for a 90 percenter. <laughs> Very cool. 62D, Benji, 90 percenter for getting the green one. Very cool. And we'll start with that roll. Yes, sweetheart. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was funny. You were you were like, please let it be a Benji, and so very cool. Glad you got it. You're gonna like it. It's a very nice coin. <laughs> you see ruler scam just now? By the way, I went back on Sunday's video and found the right spot in the live stream, then listened to it with headphones on. Jay is right. You have an adorable giggle. <laughs> She says, thank you so much. Now you know why I like listening to it all the time. I never get enough of it.
Leviathan, I agree with you. She should giggle more. <laughs> Oh, I'm here, Greg. B was talking to me in the background about something. Let's see, we're at 144, so we're only six away from the next giveaway, which is a pair of a pair of pennies, they're very cool. And um, and then if we time it right, end of the box and the giveaway at the same or the um, the one fifty giveaway at the same time. Okay, we got five thumbs down now. Yeah, it must be some of those trolls. Yeah, because I don't think we have any extra left over. Yeah, no, I don't think we do. Okay, Linda, that's what you've got so far, and you have three pulls. So let's see what we can do to add to that stack. Some pizza crumbs on the table. <laughs> Sorry about that. Tim and George, welcome. Um... So, so we're sold out, we're oversold. Okay, so we have enough to cover the five rolls, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So that's all you're asking is yes. about the five rolls? Yep. Okay. So, I don't know who it was. Uh, Kyle and Rosie. Um, we were sold out. We we actually oversold with your order. Um, it's five rolls total. We can add them. It's not a big deal. You want us to go ahead and do them tonight? We will. If you'd rather push them to another night, we'll do that too. It's it's your call. But we're here, and if you want us to do it, we'll do them. So. And Frank is in second box. Yeah, so we'll just we'll just do them. It's cool. Um, all right, ruler's back. So Linda, I did not pull any for Linda yet. So three pulls for Linda. Blank, bummer. Two more for Linda. Forty percenter, cool. Sixty-eight, forty percenter to go with the Benji. Oh, look, they're even looking at each other. Last pull.
That's funny, Scott. 90 percenter. There you go. And like we said, out of the bag, a 90 percenter is a 64 Kennedy, which, of course, as even though they made a gazillion of these when they first came out, it is a one-year coin. They only made it that one year, 90 percent. So you got the 62 Benji, 90 percent. You got the 64, 90 percent. And you got the 68, 40 percent. Very cool, Linda. Congratulations. All right, so Charles, you got the last five in the box. Unfortunately, we now know that you did not get the green one. No mark rolls. Good luck. Okay. Yep, sweetie says she's going to post the uh, order for the next box, but obviously we will have the giveaways in, betw in between when we finish uh, Charles's rolls and pulls. We'll have the giveaway, uh, probably two of them, and then we will start the second box. Two thousand four P Nifsey, nice one too. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, Lee, uh, it's um, Game of, Game of Thrones finales, you know. What are you gonna do? <clears throat> yeah, mine says 90, so.
also has three poles. Good luck, Carol. That's probably true, John. Blank on the first pole. Oh man, not the hiccups again. David L, welcome. Come on. There we go. 40 percenter. Worth the digging. 68. One more. Yep, we made it. So that'll be two giveaways. blank on the last one shoot okay so you got a 68d uh, 40 percenter and a 2004 p looks really nice nifc and ifc thank you charles so time for me to go wash hands swap boxes and then we will do two giveaways one for the end of the box and one for 150. Okie dokie. Everybody refresh your stream so you don't have any lag. You don't want to uh, miss out because you run out of time. So refresh your screens. Catherine Lee, welcome. Okay. Okay, so the giveaway for after the box is a BU mint roll and a string from Rookie Roll Hunter. He bought an entire box and saw what it was and heard how many people have said they haven't seen any of these yet, so he sent them to us to give away to the family. So right now we have 78 showing for the entries. Hundred and one. Okay. Still good odds. So good luck, everybody. Justice Redding. I have mainly 79S, so got to start looking closely. J 
Justice Redding, hope you're here. Hey, that was quick. <laughs> cool. Let that timer reset real quick. The two coin. This is a two coin set from D. Reese. It's an England penny from 2009 and a 75 Canadian penny, Queen Elizabeth on both fronts. The older Queen Elizabeth here, but still not, you know, 20 years ago. And then 75 younger versions. And yeah, I know it's, it's very hard with the dark coins. And then 75, let me see if I can get the light on it from the magnifier. That trick's worked before. Nah, not working. Um, so the Canadian is really nice. And this is the back of the British, which is a really awesome design on it. And it says one penny. And then the fronts. I really wish you guys could see these better. We get the new setup, it's going to be so much nicer. So much easier. So, so good luck, everybody. Kim! I'm going to flip this over anyway. We don't have any of those, but... Two of the 79, Susan B. Anthony, and like them. Mark, welcome. Kim, are you still here? Maybe it's a good thing I turned the sand over. Okay, Troy, um, we're sold out, and actually we're oversold out. Um, we, we, you probably have a really big lag. Um, so we can either refund it or carry it over to uh, Saturday, whichever you prefer. So Kim, you're running out of sand. Kim K. I hope you're still here. Oh no! Yeah, she might have left. Uh, out of sand. Shoot! <laughs> Kim, you were needed in coin chat stat. That's good. John Campbell, welcome. All right, Troy, we will carry it over. Thank you very much. Yeah, I know. She was she was burnt running a hundred running a hundred miles an hour trying to do all kinds of stuff, so all right. Sorry, next. Richard Ferris, Susan B. Anthony is very interesting and informative. Thank you again for all you do. Thank you, Richard. Oop, got to start the timer. Yep. Really? Bonnie, she says she does not have any for you at all. 
she didn't she didn't get a transaction from you at all. So the answer would be no, you didn't make it, but your transaction went somewhere, but it didn't go here. Sorry. Yeah, check and make sure where it went. Yeah, revise it or stop it, whatever. You might have, since you're a little loopy, you might have uh, left the S off is the most common thing that people do. Yeah, it might not have gone at all. Yeah, that's true. Richard Ferris, last call for Richard Ferris. Sand is gone. Sorry. Next, good luck. Pammy J, good info as always. Should I set the timer? <laughs> Pammy J. Ernie, welcome. Come on, Pammy, wake up. I thought she was just here a second ago. Yeah, could have been, could have been uh, another Game of Thrones. Oh man, there's Kim. Sorry, Kim. Oh, sand is out on Pammy J too. Oh man. Okay, sweetie, next. Unfortunately, good luck to everybody. A Rod, thanks for the video on Susan B. Anthony Dollars, Dollar Coins. I did not really know anything about these coins. Oh, cool. <laughs> now you do. Now yeah, now you do, yeah. A-Rod. There's A-Rod. Cool. Congratulations, A-Rod. You're going to like these. So that's it, right? Okay. For now. And that was from D. Reese, correct? Cool. Got a sheet for me, baby? No. Oh. Andre? Andre, welcome from Russia. That's okay, Bonnie. It happens a lot. Oh, Pammy, did you miss anything? Yeah, you just got called for a two-coin set. But 
so did Kim and a few other folks uh, that timed out. So, thank you, my sweet. All right, Warren Wingo is going to start this box. So, how many down, how many over? You got two rolls. Night, Greg. Number 16 and 17. Which ones would be 16 and 17? <laughs> I, I don't, I don't, I don't know where 16 and 17 are. <laughs> It's usually the, how, how many down, how many over, or something like that. But Yeah, good one, Bonnie. Second row, five to the left. Okay, second row, one, two, three, four, five. So that one. And the one next to it. Yep, got it. All right, got it. Cool. Good luck, Warren. No marked rolls. Andre, good luck at school. Thank you for coming. Nothing out of those warrant. We got one pull for you. Let's see if we can make it a good one. Forty percenter. There we go. Sixty-seven. Thank you very much. Next up, Becky Boo got six rolls. One, two, three, whoops, four, five, and six. No marked rolls.
Oh man, Bonnie, sorry to hear that. Definitely. Yeah, that's Warren's. Yeah. I'm doing Becky Boo's now. And Bonnie just texted on the stream that her mom's not doing good. Camera, welcome. Brad, welcome. Whoop, 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 whoop. Drop the shiny one. What is it? No, oh, it's 97. Forty percent are on the first pull. Very nice, sixty seven. Second pull. Forty percent are. 1 more 60. Sylvia, that's a great find. Oh, 
blank on the last one. But you got two very pretty 40 percenters, 67 and 68. Thank you very much, Becky Boo. Congrats. Next up, KCC. Two rolls. No markings. That's what it's about, Becky. It's fun to find stuff. It's fun to get stuff. But as long as it's fun, that's the important thing. on those two rolls. Let's see if we can get lucky on one pull. <laughs> it's a good one, Becky. Good luck, Casey. Ah, oh, blank. Sorry. Struck out on you, Casey. Sorry. Charles Travis is up next. Got five rolls. Yeah, B stepped out of the room a sec. Charles has the green one. That was quick in this box. Fifty nine D Benji. There you go. Ninety percent to start with. Night Pollock. Todd Lee, welcome. John, no, have not ever found one. And if I did, I would never admit to it.
Yeah, it's amazing how many mint directors over the last hundred years plus have uh, come away from that job with all kinds of unique one of a kind or four or five of a kind coins that usually don't get get discovered until their estate or through some through some third party deal. <laughs> okay, so Charles, you've got the Benji. I gotta get something out of the poles. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I'm gonna move it over there. You doing okay, sweetie? Sorry. Wow. That's hot. Um, that's Becky, yeah. Yeah, and Casey, I struck out. And Charles has the Benji. He got the green one. And I'm just getting ready to do his three pulls now. Yeah, Ronnie, the thumbs down basically are from people like the one we had earlier tonight that are trolls and they get get their way uh, shown the door and blocked from the channel. So they show up and leave a thumbs down. 40% are on the second pull. There we go. And they come back long enough. They're so smart. They come back long enough to give us a thumbs down and they leave. But what they're not smart enough to grasp. Here's a 68D for you, Charles. Um, we really don't care, number one, but number two, it actually counts as a view for us. So they're helping us. <laughs> so it's like, okay, have a nice day. See you later. Second pull. Blank. Yeah. Speaking of 90s, let's pull the 90 for Charles. So, Charles, now you have 59 Benji, 90 percenter. 64 Kennedy, 90 percenter, and 68 Kennedy, 40 percenter. Very nice. Thank you, Charles. Congratulations. Thank you, sweetie. Frank Ricks has 15 rolls. Five. Good luck, Frank. Whoop. Ten, and here comes fifteen. Let's check them. No mark rolls there. Black one there. Whoop. As I drop these. Nope, no markings on those three. So we have one black one and somebody left a purple mark on that one. So that, that doesn't count. But the black one does. That's a 40 percenter. Oh, 
Linda, I'm sorry. Excuse me. <clears throat> Something like that, Linda. Frank and somebody was leaving. Good night, Robert. <laughs> well said, Tony. Daughters will definitely mess you up, Linda. I mean, uh, change you, Linda. <laughs> Says the father of three and grandfather of one. <laughs> I keep telling them, please, somebody have a boy. Yeah, I'm okay, Troy. <clears throat> Just swallowed the wrong way. <sighs> yeah, I had somebody, when my girls were teenagers, I had somebody that, um, that knew them and, and when they were little girls. And <laughs> he hadn't seen me in probably 10 years and uh, I think yeah because I think they were like five and three and then they were about 15 13 something like that and he he was older than me he was about 75 80 years old at the time and I was about 40 something and he came up to me and the first thing he said and he had snow white hair of course was he says he says wow You've really gotten gray the last couple of years. What happened? <laughs> and how are my horseshoe buddies? That's what he always called them. <laughs> and I said, well, your horseshoe buddies are 15 and 13. He goes, oh, enough said. Now I know why you turn, <laughs> turn gray. He had two daughters that were growing up and a couple of grandkids. So, yeah, I didn't have any gray hairs till they came along, you know. <laughs> so that kind of fits with Tony's thing, too. It's like. It's like, yeah, young and dark hair and good shape. And all of a sudden you have daughters and you have gray hair and you don't sleep much. And...
Okay, Kyle. Uh, we're 42 away from the next giveaway, so you you should be good to go for a few minutes. Pup, what you want? Hmm? Whoop, 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 whoop. No, come on, get away from there. Come on, back, 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 back. Thank you. Come on, there you go. A little earthquake action here as the puppy gets settled. <laughs> oh, jeez. I guess not. What? You want on, you want, what? He just does not want to settle tonight. Yeah, Tony, uh, whenever he moves around under the table or around the tripod, that's what it looks like is an earthquake. He was trying to climb up in my lap. Yep, doing Franks. Yeah, Frank, he's uh, about 70 pounds of muscle and teeth. <laughs> and very smart. You guys will have to wait to see. Yeah. <laughs> Tony says it's part of the witness protection program that we don't show any of the family members. <laughs> That's a good one, sweetie. She says, Tony, we're not Italian. Come on. Tula Kerr. I've never heard of that breed. Wimmer Honor, I've heard of. No, get down. Get down. Mm -hmm. oh. okay. Louisiana Leopard Dog. Wow, okay.
Tony, no kidding? I thought you was maybe a Shaughnessy or something. <laughs> Macro's leaving? Mm -hmm. All right, night, Macro. Take it easy, Jason. Oh, now you want us to forget about it? Forget about it. Tony knows the guy? Yeah, yeah. Yep. That's funny, Kim. Stick to Greek singing. <laughs> so you don't want me to do Volare, Volare or... Um... What, sweetie? My voice is copyright protected. <laughs> it's only for, sing only for you now? Okay. Polls does Frank get with 75? Excuse me. Okie dokie. Tony says if Mrs. B sings with you. <laughs> so seven pulls. Forty percenter. Sixty-seven. Second pull.
40 percenter. Third pull. Forty percenter. Another sixty eight. track number four or five I think that was number four yeah this will be number four yeah thank you Becky forty percenter Another 67. Number five, if I can keep Puppy from pushing the bag out of my hand. 40. Another 68. And. Yeah, I think this is the last one. No, two more. Rosie, welcome. Forty percenter. Thank you very much. Another sixty-five. Last one, Frank, 40 percenter. Another 68. So you got eight 40 percenters. And thank you. And a 2005 P Nifsey. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Tony's up next. Got 10 rolls. Right? Yeah, 10 rolls. Black one. I'm running a little short here, sweetie. Yeah. There you go, Tony. 65. Start with. Thank you, Frank. Love the Louisiana Bayou. Every time I go down that way, I get me some charred oyster. And then I get me some shrimp poor boys with some rumelade sauce on it. Yeah, buddy.
puppy. Causing trouble over here. I got him. He's just trying. Excuse me. No, those are happy trees. <laughs> Isn't that what Bob Ross always said? Yep. Happy trees. Yeah, happy accidents, yeah. He had happy hair, yeah.
got one roll left for Frank. I'm doing one now and there's one left. And then there's ten rolls left in the box after that. Plus the, the extra rolls. Nothing out of those rolls. These are Tony's, they're not Frank's. I'm sorry. Yeah, I said Frank. So, Tony has six poles. Forty percenter. Um. Yeah, I think he said he was cool with it, and so I said we'd go ahead and open them, but we'll verify again. Second poll. Blank on the second pull. Ah, blank on the third one. Blank on the third one. Blank on the fourth one. I'm trying, sweetie. Dug all the way to the bottom for that one. Just like this one. One more pull. Two more pulls? Okay. Two more pulls. Pull six straight, and then I pull five blanks. Go figure that one out. Six blanks, or yeah. Ah, Tony, sorry about that. B's very sorry about that too. Dog, knock it off.
Yeah, like B said, at least you're laughing. John is up next. He's got 10 rolls. Which pretty much takes out the box. Plus we've got the extra rolls that she's got to confirm. Oh, I need that for the extra rolls. Okay. Okay. So Kyle, we got for an okay to do his role tonight. Rosie, we haven't heard whether he wants to do his roles. He or she wants to do their roles tonight or Saturday. Troy Long, same thing, tonight or next Saturday. So if you guys could let us know. Um, yeah, Kyle, you're going to be coming up after these roles. Black one, 40 percenter. Sixty-eight. Kyle, it's up to you, man. We've got you down as next after these rolls. So it's up to you whether you want to do them after I do these. Uh, do your roll after this. Because we got two other people after you, so it's no big deal to do yours. Uh, or if you'd prefer, we could, we could hold it till Saturday. It's your choice. Okay, cool. So, yep. So Kyle is up after after this one, and then Rosie is after Kyle if if Rosie wants to do tonight, or we can do a refund or next Saturday, whichever Rosie wants. But we got to hear from Rosie. Hey, Ida's here. Ida's here! Yay! Yep, good luck to John. So we need to hear from Rosie and we need to hear from Troy Long, whether they want to still be tonight or if we want to, they want to carry over till Saturday or get a refund. After we do Kyle, if we don't hear from them, then we'll assume they don't want us to do it tonight if they're not here. Rosie what? Okay. Hey, Ida. My digger's back. Yay. Troy Long, uh, did you want us to do yours, your rolls tonight, or do them Saturday? We have rolls set aside for you, so it's just it's up to you. You just gotta let us know. <laughs> Thank you, Linda.
Hey, Jake. Yeah, that's kind of how it goes, John. It's Some nights it kills it, and some nights not so much. Okay, so we got Rosie and Kyle. We don't know about Troy Long. Yeah. Troy's still here right now. He must have one heck of a lag or something. Doki. Cool, Troy. Thank you. Good to know. We will do that. Yep. Okay, so we got six poles, right? Okay. Good luck. Good luck. Funny money. Uh, I've never had a problem with that. 40 percenter. But if you have an account with the bank and they refuse to accept it, um, you can always try another branch. If you go to the manager and say, hey, I have an account here, you know, uh, and the manager says, well, it's too bad, or we're going to charge you, anything like that. If it's anything like, oh, I'm, other than, you know, I'm sorry, you know, yeah, well, obviously we take... If there's another branch, go to the other branch and try to turn the coin in there. If they still won't accept it, get a new bank, get a new bank even though it's your dump bank. Um, if you're talking about, a, excuse me, a credit union where you're actually, excuse me, actually a member slash owner, they have to because you're, you're an owner. Um, So poll number two coming, I believe, after all that. Oh, blank. Poll number three coming. Tell them to get a bigger vault with all the money they got. Forty. Or tell them to have the armored car company come more often. They'll have more room. 65. Number four. Yeah, I think they're kind of full of it too. Forty. Six 
Two more. Forty percenter. Uh, the credit union talk to her manager because she's lying to you. Last pull. Blank. Bummer. Uh, four out of six, though. And with the marked roll, you wind up with five 40 percenters. So thank you, John. Yeah. You took my pen. I don't know. Thanks. <laughs> You're giggling? Okay, Kyle's up. One roll. No mark rolls. Good luck, Kyle. Uh, yeah, Kyle, we're going to need your address. Anybody that wins anything tonight... Um, or this weekend, obviously, we're going to need you to send us an email to jbcoinsinc at gmail.com. Forget the PayPal part, okay? That's our email address. Send us your screen name, your real name, your mailing address, and what you want so we can send you your stuff. You got one week to claim your prizes or you forfeit them. Nada. Sorry, Kyle. Yep. Thank you so much, man. Unfortunately, with one roll, you don't get any pulls. So we had to find something in the roll for you. And this box is not finding much for anybody. So apologize. Hopefully you're having a good time anyway. And maybe Saturday or Sunday you can, you can uh, catch some. Some goodies out of the the new box, uh, the new boxes that we're picking up. Getting a bunch of the double stackers. So these are Rosies. Good luck, Rosie. No marks. Very cool. Rosie's first time. Kyle says he paid for two. We did one. Oh, we did one in the first box? Gotcha. Two in the first box? Mm -hmm. Okay, so then this is the third one. Okay. He paid for three. Okay. Ah, okay, so you got one coin from the first box. Yeah, we did two rolls for you in the first box, and then... Um, the one now. So you did get one coin out of the first box. 
So, and this is a bicentennial. Uh, it's kind of a wannabe. It's got the rainbow ring around the outside. So, that's Rosie's. Happy birthday, John. It doesn't look like we're going to make it to 200 likes, but we've got an end of the box giveaway still. So when we finish all these rolls and pulls, um, we will have one more giveaway. Wow, Robert, your parents' 65th wedding anniversary today? Very cool. I'd like to get 65 years married to my sweetie. That would be nice. Two pulls for Rosie. Forty percenter. Sixty eight D. Forty percenter, very cool. Two for two. Sixty-seven. So you got sixty-seven and sixty-eight, and you got a bicentennial rainbow wannabe. Congratulations. Good night, Toddly. Last up. Troy Long, two rolls, and one pull after these, ah, 40 percenter, 68, good luck, 68. all right Mud, take care. Joe Rob, welcome.
Okay, Troy, last roll. And then you got to pull, so. Okay. There's that. And one pull. Oh, you're 15 minutes from New Orleans? Man, no kidding. You up towards Metairie or are you down, uh, down towards 40% uh, or Troy? Oh man, I can't think of it now. Um, where they have all the fishing rodeos uh, down there. Uh, it's like due south of New Orleans. Um, now Lake Charles is to the east of New Orleans. Sweetie, I need uh, I need a nice forty percenter here. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I'm, okay. 67 to go with your 68. There you go, Troy. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Um, yeah, I mean, there's the Tarpon Rodeo. There's a bunch of different rodeos that I know about down there. Um, I used to be involved with one a long time ago, um, but uh, it was that rodeo. They basically gave trophies and prizes and stuff for for the largest catch of each different type of fish, basically. And then they just had a big old, <laughs> big old Cajun home style dinner um, at a at a clubhouse, but. Um, it was a camp. Um, I'm trying to think of the name of the place. I think if I remember right, it got wiped out by Katrina and then they rebuilt it and it, it gets nailed like every time a hurricane comes ashore there because it's like the farthest part out there. Um, I don't know why I'm drawing a blank on it. You were you were in Katrina. That was no fun. I had family in Biloxi that luckily we were able to talk out of town before it hit. And then I was in New Orleans six months to the day after Katrina. Um, so anyway, that's it for rolls. Now we have a giveaway for the end of the box. So, yep, this roll is different than the other one. This one is from David Powers. Yes, I know, baby. So we had 101 entries. We have 113 entries. We got 83 people walking, uh, watching, and and we had a lot of uh, turnover. So we'll see how long it takes to give this away. This is uh, our 2019 roll of BU Fed Wrap. You know, straight out of the mint. So you got 50 beautiful 2019s in there that could have errors. We just ate, we just updated our penny list and I think Yeah, or just beautiful gradable coins. I think I added 10 or 12. Do you remember? For the 2019? Anyway. Anyway. So good luck to everybody.
P. Nelson. Seems like either one should be worth more than that, maybe in a few years. Yep, probably. Yeah, I said hi to Glastron. Night, Glastron. <laughs> oh my God, I, I'm here. <laughs> Very cool. Congratulations. Flip that little sand thing back over. We don't need it tonight. Oh, that was a lot quicker than I expected. <laughs> I had a funny feeling we were going to have one of those long ones. Especially after the first one, it took so long. Oh, man. Oregato, you were up north when the tsunami hit down south. You're lucky, man. That's good. What, sweetie? Yeah, it was a great live stream. Uh, yeah. Yep. If anybody. Yep. So, sweetie said that if anybody's got any questions, now's a good time. And the good news is that Saturday and Sunday we will have the new boxes, the square ones, the double stacks that everybody likes. The ones that, that have all the nice, cool stuff, you know, the mega box like Donna's and, and Caden's and uh, the ones that last week were putting out. Uh, um, yeah, 150, 60 Nipsies, whatever it was, in one box and, and uh, quite a few Mr. Balboa's and uh, S proofs and all that kind of stuff. Those were all coming out of mostly those double stacks. And, uh, we're picking up a bunch of them at the end of this week. So should be a fun weekend. Um, yeah, would that I could, Rocky. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm, waiting, I'm waiting for them to have the two-for-one sale, you know? So <laughs> just, just load the truck up till the front wheels are barely touching the ground, you know? So what, sweetie? Yes, there are uh, er there are two errors on the 2019, and there are what is it eight? No, how many on the on the P? That's what I'm saying. I understand that. Okay. So anyway. Your favorite part was kicking the trolls out? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. Are there any planches other than steel that react to magnets? Um, good question. Shouldn't be. Uh, I don't think the zinc will react to a magnet. I mean, maybe if you have a strong enough magnet, it might, because zinc is really not that, um, not that, it's normally not attracted to metal. I mean, uh, particularly with the copper coating on it. Uh, copper, of course, is not attracted, I mean, yeah, you know what I mean, to the magnet. The, the copper itself, of course, is not attracted to the magnet, um, even though it's a great conductor of electricity. Um, but, um, no, not, not, a, not aware of, um, uh, you know, um, you know, steel, steel of some sort. Okay. So. Silver biomagnet, I've never heard of either. Well, yeah, if you have a strong enough magnet, maybe, yeah. Yeah. Um, all right. So, anyway, um, had a great time tonight. Everybody have a safe and fun rest of your week.
And we will see y'all uh, Saturday or Sunday or both at 7 p.m. Eastern. And uh, again, another great live stream. And uh, God bless. Sleep tight. And uh, till then, JNB signing off.